Father Pedro Arupe was a Spanish Jesuit who served as the 28th Superior General of the Society of Jesus between 1965 to 1983. Before his time as Superior General of the Society of Jesus, Arupe worked in Japan as Master of Novices and eventually as Provincial of the Japanese province. On the 6th of August, 1945, he heard the sirens well as a single American B-29 bomber flew over the city of Hiroshima. He did not think much of it and expected to hear the all-clear siren soon. Instead, he heard an enormous explosion and felt the concussion that blew in the doors and windows of his residence. Moving outside, Arupe and his colleagues saw the first of the 200,000 casualties of the atomic bomb. Walking up the hill, they saw the city of Hiroshima turning into a lake of fire. Arupe decided to use his medical training to help whomever he could. He and his colleagues were able to give aid to 150 victims. As Superior General of the Society of Jesus, Arupe led the society in the realities of serving the church and people in the post-Vatican II world. He was a man of great spiritual depth who was committed to justice. Hence, he was most concerned that Jesuits make a commitment to addressing the needs of the poor. His work resulted in the decree from the 32nd General Congregation calling Jesuits to the service of faith and the promotion of justice. In 1980, he founded the Jesuit Refugee Service to respond to the plight of refugees around the world. For Arupe, the plight of refugees was an opportunity to respond to the mandate given by St. Ignatius of Loyola to the Jesuits. Go anywhere where we are most needed for the greater glory of God. Today, JRS is present in over 50 countries and over the years has served an estimated 40 million refugees globally. Arupe's belief in justice informed his understanding of the goal of Jesuit education. Arupe gave Jesuit schools the prime educational objective to form men and women for others, men and women who will live not for themselves but for God and his Christ. Arupe was convinced that the love of God must be seen in acts that bring about justice. Therefore, Jesuit education today must convey a faith that does justice, raising men and women of competence, conscience, commitment, and compassion. Arupe Jesuit University, Harare, Zimbabwe, the first Jesuit university in Southern Africa, is one of the several Jesuit institutions across the globe named after Pedro Arupe. AJU not only follows the mandate of the Society of Jesus to provide quality education to Africa, but also follows the special mandate from Pedro Arupe to educate people whose faith will bring about justice. The students and staff of AJU are not merely focused on academic rigor, but are also committed to giving preference to the poor around them. AJU collaborates with several other institutions in Zimbabwe to respond to social issues such as human trafficking, child protection, empowerment and education of the destitute, and the promotion of the African culture and heritage. AJU is not only committed to innovation, excellence and accountability, but also to mutuality cultural diversity and transformational morality. This culture of transformation is evident in the legacies left by Pedro Arupe himself. On the 13th of July 2018, a cause began in the Diocese of Rome for the beatification of Father Pedro Arupe. On the 5th of February 2019, the official opening of the process of his cause of beatification was held in Rome. As we celebrate Arupe Day today, we not only join our hearts in celebration of the legacy he left as a Jesuit, but we journey with Jesuits and friends across the world in praying for God's guidance on the church as Pedro Arupe gradually becomes a saint in the Catholic Church.